Hi there, a Premier League game for you today. I'm Martin Tyler, and to call the action alongside me, Alan Smith. In our game today, West Ham United against Crystal Palace. And your Irons, West Ham United. West Ham United line up today. Number 25, Joe Hart. Number 5, Pablo Zabaleta. Number 2, West Ham United's lineup is this. Joe Hart starts in goal. Angelo Ogbonna starts with Winston Reid in central defence. Andre Ayo starts with Marco Anatovic in the wide positions. Javier Hernandez is the main striker today. Number 20, Andre Ayo. Number 27, Marco Anatovic. Number 10, Manuel Lazzini. Here's the Crystal Palace team. Wayne Hennessy plays in goal. Ruben Loftus Cheek plays with Wilfred Zaha looking to provide width. Christian Benteke is the sole striker today. Well, West Ham United took over the London Stadium at the start of the 2016-17 season. Quite a bit of an adjustment for them from their previous ground, but it's helped turn this multi-sport arena into a stadium fit for football. Yeah, and I think the great thing about it is it holds so many people. And I think we'll see some fantastic atmospheres inside this ground in the next few years. Thank you. Enjoy the game. For a while, Alan, Crystal Palace were a yo-yo club that kept getting to the Premier League and getting relegated straight away. But they've now, despite changing their manager regularly for all sorts of reasons, they're looking more consistent as though they belong on a longer term at the top table of English football. Yeah, and they're trying to improve the infrastructure, aren't they, across the board in order to establish themselves in the top flight. That's got to be the aim. Christian Benteke. Clever feet there to go inside his man. He's had a go here. Oh, nowhere near. No, he's miscued that one. Miscued it badly. Zabaleta. Andre Ayu. Played forward. A bit of menace in this attack. Hernandez going to try his luck right from the kickoff they look like scoring they have now sharp from the off and what a good goal he looked the goalkeeper in the eyes and said right I've got the win here and he's got the goal to show that and I love that kind of finish when you don't have to blast it as long as the placement is right West Ham with this advantage. Goal for West Ham United. Number 10. It's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. Praise for trying the shot, Alan. Well, his teammates aren't too happy. for a throw Joel Ward really trying to use the full width of the pitch here to make some progress well no danger from that cross because the defender can cope with it easily that's good movement forward here these two have got a great understanding with their passing going for goal well that's gone behind for a corner Can he finish? Now the shot! And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. And the goalkeeper, it's his ball. Oh, 
too early offside an easy one for the linesman he was a good couple of yards oh yeah he wants to play on the shoulder of the last defender he's just got to get it right it's all about timing yeah, he's having a little go at his teammate. He did want that pass earlier. Simple save for Wayne Hennessy. Straightforward stop from an effort from a long, long way out. Marco Anatovic. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Promising build up until that challenge. And they cut it out. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Won it back with an interception. It was good play until they got that challenge in. Patrick van Arnholt. Well, I like the look of this attack. Good defending. There was danger, but he's cleared it. Well, that'll be a throw. Joel Ward. Plenty of width for the team to attack into. Neatly intercepted. Good looking build up, and it rather petered out. Three minutes from the referee by the fourth official. That's the decision. Regarding added time. Tried his luck from a long way.